All right, Coco, you know, thank you doesn't quite seem enough when you're talking about someone who saved your life. That is right. And today in Hazel Park, a young hockey player hit the ice along with the trainer who recently gave him CPR when that player went into cardiac arrest. Victor Williams shows us the unique bond these two now enjoy. Yeah, guys, talk about a bond that's absolutely beautiful. A young man went into cardiac arrest out here on the ice, and it was his athletic trainer who sprang into action and saved his life. It's a moment 15-year-old Connor Place barely remembers even happened. I just remember the drill we were doing, and then I remember, you know, being on the stretcher. Just two days after Christmas, Place collapsed right in the middle of the rink at Hazel Park Ice Arena. Thank goodness his athletic trainer, Eric Schwab, a certified health professional employed by the Henry Ford system, was there. Uh, he wasn't responding, he wasn't getting up, so I went over to him and and started my evaluation. Schwab worked to revive the U of D Jesuit high school player using CPR and an AED, ultimately helping the 15 year old's heart to beat at a more effective rhythm. I wouldn't say I'm a hero. I, you know, athletic trainers are, are meant to act in emergency situations. We're trained to do these types of things. Place now wears an implantable defibrillator to monitor his heart. And although he's sidelined for the rest of the season, he now shares a connection with this trainer that will last an entire lifetime. Yep. Now it's, yeah, every time I see Connor's parents, I, I have to give him a hug, and that's kind of our little thing we do now at, at games or if I see him at the school or whatever the case may be. I feel like we'll get even closer from here on out, but. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. And Schwab was honored with the civilian award at a recent city council meeting from the police chief, Brian Buckle. So obviously a lot of people are offering their gratitude. Reporting in Hazel Park, Victor Williams, Local 4.